So, I recorded this entire video. It's about five minutes, six minutes in length. And I went to edit it, and I went into it, and for some reason I had, like, a ridiculous amount of background noise. So, uh, I am re-recording it. Um, I still have the video here, but I'm just going to be talking over it, just so you guys know, and it's not awkward. Uh, basically, all I was saying in this video is that uh, I had been uh, farming Seed of Dreams uh, to get those token, or that, or not tokens, like those buffs, so that... Uh, I could farm that new that new mount, and um, when I was farming, when I got home from work today, farmed for maybe like an hour and 40 minutes or something like that, I actually got three 8-coin drops, uh, which can be exchanged along with uh, the other tokens for 2018 to get me uh, four uh, DK coins each. Um, so, as you can see here, I have like a stack of like 51. Um, I was talking about something there, I don't even remember what, but I'm showing off the 8 coins now. Uh, but after I exchange those, I'll have 60, which is enough for the essence I need in order to upgrade my Perpetus. Um, and I had maybe 29 of those DK tokens from before, because you, well, okay, you still can, but there's like a daily quest you can do uh, that changes locations every day to get a coin. So I had like 29 from that. And then I was just doing the monster uh, target hunt thing every day, which gets you one coin a day. Uh, and then I got a couple eight drops before, and then I got these three eight drops today. Uh, so uh, you'll see here I'm going to exchange those, and then I'll have enough to buy the essence to upgrade my Perpetus. Um, in addition to that, I think I had or I had enough uh Matera Angers to attempt to upgrade my Fang as well so we'll see if I get that or not uh but as you can see here I just exchanged all of that so now I have a bunch of those DK coins and I needed 60 to upgrade so I'm going to go in here and I'm going to exchange my DK coins for a essence I can't remember if it's the infinite or the eternal but uh I'm exchanging that so that takes about a minute or so to do uh, but yeah, I've been farming a bunch. Um, it took me about a week to get those 1,000 Seed of Dreams. And I actually just read on the uh, Duckron Facebook page that they're going to end this event in a week. And like, what does that mean? Does that mean the map's going to disappear? Or we're not going to be able to farm the pet anymore? I don't even know. But I just, I don't feel like that's enough time to farm all of that. I really don't. Uh, <laughs> I, uh... Like I said, it took me a whole week to farm about a thousand seeds, and that's not even going to be enough to farm. That's definitely not going to be enough to farm the costume. And I just, I wish there was more time, uh, and I just don't think it's realistic to farm all those seeds and to farm the thing within two weeks for like someone who works, you know, someone who works forty hours a week. Uh, anyway, here I am. I I got the uh, essence thing or whatever, and now I'm exchanging it with the uh, perpetus to get the infinite perpetus, and then we'll see the stats that I'm gonna get. I was hoping for good rolls, and well, you'll just have to wait and see what happens. Uh, but yeah, I don't know. Uh, this uh, Valentine's Day event that just came out was uh, pretty dumb, given that the items only drop in. Uh, Arcadia, where you have to either farm seeds to farm in there or pay to farm in there. So that was kind of greedy of them to do. But am I honestly surprised by it? No, not even a little bit. Uh, but let's see what happens. Anyway, here I go. I'm claiming the uh, Perpetus. Oh, what are the stats going to be? What are they going to be? What are they going to be? Ah, they were, they, were, they were actually pretty bad. I got 1% abnormal status res, which is horrible. I did get 8% cooldown, which is kind of nice, and like maybe a little bit under 600 mastery, but 1% abnormal res, oh, that's so bad. So I'm definitely going to have to, I'm definitely going to have to re-roll that. Uh, so I'll, I'll just keep saving up those DK coins, and uh, at, at least I only have to get up to 20 now in order to re-roll it, so that's good. But I'll keep re-rolling that until I get, you know, something better. I'm hoping for at least over 10% abnormal res, so that might take me a while. We'll see. Um, anyway, that's uh, that's all I really... Oh, wait. Oh, no. There's one more thing. I did uh, attempt to upgrade my fang here, as you'll see in a minute. 
Uh, so I exchange all of my Matera Angers, and then I go for the upgrade. And uh, wait, hold on, there's one right in her face. So I click once, and I'm going to click again. And ah, I fail. So I was saying in the video that that's probably like my 12th or my 13th fail. So, well, you know, we'll just keep farming the Angers. As I continue to farm seeds, I'll get more Angers, and I'll keep trying to upgrade that. And I, hopefully you'll see a video soon of me actually successfully upgrading that. Uh, anyway, that's all I really had. Um, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Um, you know, subscribe if you want to see more content. Uh, uh, it makes it easier for you to keep up with my videos, and I appreciate getting more subscribers because it lets me know that you guys are interested in watching my videos. Uh, but yeah, uh, anyway, guys, until next time, take care.